Seems chivalry isn't dead. No, but Reader Phillips certainly will be by the end of this poem. And earlier it was men who were chivalrous. The knight in charming, charming, the knight in shining armor and whatnot. You wanted equal rights? Er stand an seines Schlosses Brüstung, der Ritter Phipps in voller Rüstung. Da hörte er von unten Krach und sprach zu sich, ich schau mal nach und lehnte sich in voller Rüstung weit über die erwähnte Brüstung. Hierbei verlor er also bald zuerst den Helm und dann den Halt, wobei verfolgend stur sein Ziel, er pausenlos nach unten fiel. Und hier verlor er durch sein Streben als drittes nun auch noch sein Leben, an dem er ganz besonders hing. Der Blechschaden war nur gering. Schlussfolgerung, falls fallend du vom Dach verschwandest, so brems, bevor du unten landest. Have you seen parts of the Caribbean? Oh my god, I love those movies. You remember the island Tortuga where everybody got drunk? You mean the bar in the next room? No, no. Well, yes, but anyway, Tortuga means tortoise in Spanish, if you didn't know. This poem tells the story of a fancy tortoise who bought a beautiful sombrero but sadly lost it. Let's hear about this Spanish tortoise. Please give a, gra please give a grand welcome to Anastasia, who has just recently taken up Spanish. Iba una tortuga por la capital, iba despistada con tanto autocar. Buscaba una tienda, quería comprar un sombrero nuevo y media su par. Se compró un sombrero y tan elegante, salió de la tienda. Pasó una tartana, cruzó una calesa, pasó un autocar y tres bicicletas. Y la tortuguita guarda su cabeza. Cuando de nuevo su cara asomó. Pobre sombrerito, se lo atropelló una tartanita con un percherón. La tortuga dijo, qué fatalidad, yo me voy al campo, qué asco de ciudad. Stefan, I have a great idea for what you could say for, po for your graduation speech. A little head start. What did you have in mind? Well, how about Tsai Bia Kang Chao? Chao? Where, where are you going? We have to host. No, it means goodbye Cambridge in Chinese. Well, it should. I apologize, my Chinese is not very good. Yeah. Um, Just like the author of this poem, I will also be saying goodbye to Cambridge, but not before they got me to host. Anyway, let's hear Jenny's reciting of this parting poem of education. Chingting 软泥上的清新彩虹似的梦
。悄悄是别离的笙箫，夏虫也为我沉默，沉默是今晚的康桥。悄悄的，我走了，正如我悄悄的来，我轻轻的招手，作别西天的云彩。Stefan. What's with your jacket? Well, since the first line of this poem is "Sve posta napačke," everything is going wrong backwards. I decided to wear my suit backwards for the occasion. Wonderful. Moving on. Without further ado, a warm welcome for Maxim. Keeping in mind the bravery it takes to come on stage and take the spotlight. A big round of applause, please. Sve je pošlo na opačke, za vrapci i mačke, kada je sam okačila svoje žute značke. Pažnja, pažnja, velika jesniku poprodaje. Prodajemo suncobrane, kupujemo kišobrane. Prodajemo starolišće, kupujemo pahulice. Prodajemo tretinete, kupujemo sanke. Kupujemo šubere, prodajemo mašne. Prodat ćemo sokne, kupit ćemo rukavice. Prodat ćemo sejelice, kupit ćemo grejelice. Prodat ćemo sladolet, popit ćemo čaj, jer Sve je pošlo strmoglavce, za ptici i cveće, Kad je sunce odustalo, na krov da nam sleće, Kao da je žuto, ljuto, kao da nas neće. Muzika 